first boxing contest of the evening. And he's scheduled over three one and a half minute rounds of action. Please welcome firstly into the blue corner. Representing AK's gym, Frank Smith. I'm sorry I hit it at first. I probably didn't even believe me. I kept going. His opponent across the ring into the red corner. Representing the SXF gym, Alfie English, sorry, title fight. We go to three one and a half minute rounds of boxing. Frank Smith from AK's gym in the blue. Alfie Copperthwaite from the SXF gym in the red. Big support for this young man. So three one and a half minute rounds of boxing. After all the excitement of that five round vacant kickboxing title fight. Just the punches will settle this one. And it's Smith pushing forward in the red helmet, looking to back Copperthwaite up. Copperthwaite looking to stand his ground. Smith looking to throw the left and right close. Just off balance there, it was more body to body than a punch that pushed Copperthwaite back. Smith definitely the aggressor in the early part of this opening round. And again, Smith looks to land that right hand, but Alfie just down a range. Short right hand from Alfie as they break. Looking to work behind the jab now, the red corner slips nicely as Frank Smith looks to put pressure on him again. Short right hand from Smith does land. The second right's tucked up and a three punch burst from Copperthwaite as Smith comes forward once more. Nice right hand from Copperthwaite as he stays in the pocket with Frank Smith. Nice right hand again, the exclamation mark of that exchange from the two young men. Left hand of Smith was good, but tight guard with the right hand 
from Copperthwaite. Not much between them for me. Just the cleaner work, as in just getting through on a couple of occasions for me was Alfie Copperthwaite taking just that first round. So, round two of three. And Alfie not wanting to touch gloves here, wanting to get straight down to business. Looking to come forward, Smith responds good. Left hand from Smith. Looks for the left and right, Copperthwaite looking to respond. Smith warned about holding there. Copperthwaite looking to block and throw the right hand counter. As Smith comes forward. And again, Copperthwaite just missing with the right, Smith ducking low. Clive, our referee, warning him there not to duck so low underneath the hook. Copperthwaite working the body as they stay in close, looking to work himself free. Nice movement of the head from Copperthwaite just to avoid those punches. But what I like to see is once he avoids them, just to snap back in, make them miss, make them pay. Not that I've got any bias here, I'm just saying on the commentary here that once you make someone miss with good head movement like that, you snap back and throw a reply. Easy said than done when I'm sat here, not in the ring, taking those punches. But it's half the battle, and every coach will tell you, make them miss, then make them pay. By the same token, if I were Frank Smith, I'd faint coming forward to lure Alfie Copperthwaite on because Copperthwaite is used to Frank Smith pouring forward and then responding. You faint coming forward and then see what you can bring there. But as you saw there, he comes forward, he commits fully each time, giving Copperthwaite the chance to respond. That said, neither young man has got through particularly cleanly here in the second. So third and final round. Let's see if one of these boys can land up really cleanly and turn this one on its head. It's been pretty close so far. Neither lad getting through with a telling shot. A couple of good right hands from Copperthwaite through the channel. And again, Smith can be warned for ducking low. Told to keep his head up. And away they go once more. And again, Copperthwaite moves his head nicely out the way. And lands just with the left hand on the end of that combination. Looking to push the man back, working the body. Smith looking to hold, but the left hand through the channel from Copperthwaite. As Smith tried to hold. On the right, Copperthwaite coming on strongly here in the third. And again, the right hand clean. Best shot of the night of this bout so far from Alfie, Alfie Copperthwaite. Set up the right with the left and it went right through the channel. Smith took it well, but he had to take it. And again, just out of range with that looping right hand. Copperthwaite looks for the straight right again. It's been his best weapon tonight here in this boxing. And again, three punch flurry to get through as you feel that Frank Smith beginning to feel the pace. Told to keep his head up once more. And right at the bell, it's Copperthwaite pushing forward again. And I think the red corner will take this decision as well. And that decision goes in favour of the red corner.
sunny and a broad bay in the city.